right. I swear to God. What's updating now? I don't need to record it. Uh, actually, no, nah, that'll install. It's fine. I'll let that install. <sighs> this, this is gonna. This bench is terrible. I swear to God. Get volume up. Alright. How's that sounding? You have to let me know. I don't want it to be too loud. Who reads these? No one. It could be saying that they're gonna kill me in five years. I'll just accept to it. Accept it. Yeah, I'll play on my own. Just double check things are set up. I want subtitles. Hang on. Left is invisible. Yeah, left is not invisible right now. There you go. That is that the brightness I have to be on? Hello there. Holy shit. I've just gone down 35 brightness levels. Okay, this is going to be even worse now. If there's a way to dim my monitors on the left and right, then I would. But I don't think I can. Um, I don't think I can. Right, I need to... Immerse. What's, that? What's my control battery on? Cool. I'll turn it up a bit more. Um, let me know if it's too loud and I'll turn it down. That's where the money come from. I swear to God. I hate horror games with a passion. I actually do. I can't play, um, what's it called now? Ah, fuck, the one with the camera. Out, Outlast? I can't play that. Mm -mm. I don't like it. I don't like it. Say my he my ha then. Okay. Why is my? Oh no, it's fine. Thing just cut off. Then. Alrighty, Buster. We better mosey on back to the ship. Let's go. Whoa. Stop the Hello, Samuel. Presses. What? Looks like old Charlie Charming's got a little business to attend to. Can I fight? Hey, give me a quarter. Why? I'm gonna find out my future. <laughs> I want to find out my future. Let's have it. What's in store for me, Pop? You uh, I'm good, Sam. How are you? Um, I'm good. Sam, how are you? So, uh, when am I gonna hit the jackpot? You know, uh, all that glitz and glamour. That's like the um, stereotypical question everyone asks. Oh, will I be rich? We'll see. Um, let's go. No, 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 that sounded rosy from immersion. <laughs> dragon or bamboo, dragon or bamboo, dragon or bamboo. Let's go with my head. I saw the brain and the heart, and I thought the brain's like your head. I think. Obviously, your heart is your heart, but I think the brain's like your. 
all our picks. It a fish? Looks like a fish. Oh no, I'm destined to work at Whitbiz for my entire life. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Doom? Wait, what? What does that mean? Oh, I should hey, laugh that at mean? that. That's what the hell, it was just man? there. It was there. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, bud. Let me get a go at it. Oh yeah? Think you got the stuff? Oh. I just saw the fish and sure. it came into my head. Let me know the quarter. I'm gonna start a tab. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give it a whirl. Harry's Hello. anime art to work at a fish and chippy. Thank you for the five bits, Jack. Much appreciated. You're damn right. You're damn right. Thank you very much for the five bits, man. Thank you very much. Oh. oh my god. I might actually disable sound alerts, you know. Ooh, good dodge. Yeah. It's like a Dalek, this. My arms come out. Whoa, don't you trash talk me. Do you think he's dead? Well, this thing is, yeah. <laughs> Oh, I just got smacked in the head. I weren't looking. <laughs> oh, don't you laugh at me. Have a nice day. Whoa, what are you, what are you saying there, Joel? Whoa. Hey, Chuck, we better get back to the ship. We don't want to get stranded. Come on, man, just let me ask another question. We really need to get back. Uh, right, so he's reckless, eager, insecure, selfish, altruistic. And that guy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I may. I may have to make the executive decision to disable sound alerts. I won't actually, because if you time one, that's like the bits one. That's a jump scare one. Nah, nah, keep him on. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> I'll keep him on the way. Right, I don't like the music. Can we stop this? Should be loud enough. That was way too loud before. I'm sorry, chat. Oh, you want me to get rid of my event list? Oh, wait, what? Why is that on there? Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Fucking hell, I just ruined the immersion even more. Fuck. Here we go. Right, it's off. We're good. Pro streamer. <laughs> Fuck. What's in that fucking box? Well, those three boxes, even. Lovely. That's all the lube leaking out. Fuck's sake, I'm gonna have to order some more. Hello there. Okay, so that's gonna reanimate the dead. 
these fucks. guys in chat are mad. Do you know that? You actually are mad. <laughs> oh, alright. So what's this? Alright, so I'm guessing this is his son because he was, talk he was gonna ask about it. Uh, yeah, yeah. Ask about... Ask Shut it, the fuck, fuck up before I get you to do some special activities. Maybe don't say that when I've just picked up a picture of this guy's son. Um, madness, Sam. That's mad. <laughs> Fucking hell. Alright, cool. Just a dead guy. Ooh, money. Shut the fuck up before I get you to do some special activities. Don't say it when a dead corpse is on the floor, Sam. Jesus. <laughs> oh, no, it's Joel. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> I, didn't see, I, ju I didn't see the name. I just assumed it was you again. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, right, what am I looking at here? I'm just looking at his corpse. I can't zoom in on anything. Oh, whoops. Why am I... Wait, so why is it giving, given, giving me the option to inspect him if I can't inspect jack shit on him? Like, no? What's the point? I'm just looking at a dead corpse. Okay. Right, I think it's time I leave the room. Yes. Oh my god, Sam. Oh my god. Mental. Right, where do I go? Okay, that way. I don't like how dark this game is, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you. Out of here already. Wow. What the hell's going on up there? Heard aircraft and gunfire. Me too. And there was a a corpse. What? In the sick bay. Something's wrong. Let's get out. Would there be a better place for my camera to go, chat? I'm thinking top left. I'm thinking top left. guys are something else. But it's fine because I love you for it. Uh, where is... Where is it? Sorry for the pause. I'm just trying to look for something. Where the fuck are you? You're a fucker. You're actually. Thank you for the five bits, Sam. You're a bastard. I was about to get rate right hyped up then as well. Wait, can I go in that room? Whoa, we'll go back. <laughs> oh, a safe. Do we know the combination lock? Yeah, because just opening it without the combination will work. They can't. Uh, right. Okay, so I'm just gonna engage. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, now. Yes, sir. Oh, what's this? Wow. 
one day and left. Petty theft, one day break, smartness. Jesus Christ. Fucking hell. I'll stop now, no problem. <laughs> oh, blood. What are you not telling me? Uh, I don't know his name out there, but what's he not telling me? There's blood on your wall, bro. What have you done? Right, oh god, that's a really close angle. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Why did that get me, man? Why did that get me? As if he doesn't check that corner. As if he didn't check that corner. Fucking hell. I don't even know who played that. Thank you very much, whoever it was. I, I, I can't see. And if you use bits for that, I can't remember if you need to or not. Thank you very much. I, it's just not showing me in chat. Thank you very much. Fucking kids, man. I hate them. I hate them. Scary little fuckers. <sighs> Scary fucking bastards. Charlie, there you are. Where have I not explored this area though? Fuck! Oh. <laughs> Alright, pull another Fuck dead guy. Hell. Yeah, you said it. Fubar and that son. What's back here though? I think I, I feel like I missed something, didn't I? Like, can I, I can't even go back. Ah, you dickhead, Harry. I bet I've missed something. God damn Another dead guy. Another de oh, damn it. Buckley. Last time I saw him in the mess hall, he was fit as a fiddle. Poor fucker. Fuck you, yeah, no. These camera angles are fucking mental, you know. I read it. I read it in the chat before it played. Thank you very much for the five bits, Sam. <laughs> fucking hell, it's so realistic, though. So realistic. So, uh, Do you know what I need to get? I need to get a heart rate monitor for these games. Or are you getting a real strange feeling right now? Well, it looks like I really do. Like to talk about his feelings. <laughs> you look like a mess on wheels, Chuck. I ain't the only one. Great. Good company. God, the echo in this room. That actually got me pretty good. That shut me up. Fucking hell. Charlie, get over here. 
Jesus. Sorry, why some of those faces are funny. <laughs> are we shooting? Let's shoot people. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah, of course, mate. I just. Oh, fucking hell. And jump scare in three. Fuck. I was doing a countdown. <laughs> exactly. Fucking hell. Hey. Come here. Oh God, no. No, I don't like this. My heart rate, I don't like this. I don't like this. Mm -mm. Shoot him. Shoot it. Kill it now with fire. Sorry, how many shots did you miss? Oh no, it's gonna open it and the kid's gonna go boo or some shit. Don't do it. Hello. <laughs> Lovely. I don't think just smashing the Morse code machine is gonna help you transmit your message. What the fuck? Shut the fuck up and blow. I get you into this. God can't save you now, boy. Oh dear. Oh my god, Joel. Fucking hell. Oh, fucking hell. Yes. I'm all for this. Yeah. Feel it. Come on. Keep it coming. Yes. Oh my god. W. This fucking intro music is a W. Can I have some glove dubs in chat, please? I still have a glove dub, right? I can't remember. Whoops. <laughs> well, what is this that I can't see with my ceiling spinning over me? Oh, hi, there you go. Super massive games, damn right. Super massive. Like my car, I'm joking. Well, I'm not joking, but you know.
Yes. 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 Absolute elite intro. Amazing. And elite music in the background. Hello. Oh, hello. And welcome. You speaking to me? To my repository. Oh, God, I don't like this. Creepy man. You creepy dude. Welcome to my repository. I don't want to know what's in this repository. Hello there. Hey, elite music, by the way. I am the curator, the curator of stories. Oh, tell of me love, a story. Hate, greed, and beauty. Life. That sounded creepy, didn't it? Should have from me, then. Stories such as this one. Hang on. Excuse I'm me. here to record the story you choose to tell. Okay. You see, this tale is only part written, and the choices you make will complete it. Mm -hmm. and determine whether the lives of those with whom you are interfering continue to flourish or whether they are snuffed out. Hmm, I see, I see. You see, we each Glove make decisions noted in chat, according please. to our own moral compass. Mm -hmm. And we have to live with those decisions or die by right. them. But you shouldn't fear death. It is, mm -hmm. after all, inevitable. Mm -hmm. It is the tax one pays for having lived, and it comes eventually mm -hmm. to everybody mm -hmm. still none of us want for it to come too soon do we some people like it when it comes soon sorry what as in life the actions you take mm -hmm. matter the choices you make will affect others mm -hmm. i'll be keeping a close eye on your progress mm -hmm. it's not my place to interfere but i might be persuaded to offer the occasional hint right here's one for free there are pictures in this world that can show you some possible futures. Right. If you can find them and study them, they may just help you to make better decisions. Right. Or should I say, decisions that result in the outcomes you would prefer. Mm-hmm. That's all for the moment. We'll talk again soon enough. We'll have the opportunity to account Splendid. for the actions that you've taken. Splendid. Whatever mess you've made. Hey, I'm not gonna make a mess. I'm not gonna make a fucking mess. Oh, oh, look at that! What a nice place to stop. All right then, just jump into it. Can I? Look at that water. Mmm. I'm a sucker for nice water textures. That looks quite well decent. It's nice for a lot. Of of recent games I've played, that's the best water I've seen for a while, so I'm gonna be nerding out over it. Ooh. Why have you played that music? He's brought the beer. It's not a sad moment. <laughs> Why is it paused on him? <laughs> Alright. I've not been reading these texts about motivated and insecure, by the way. Fuck. Got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water? Diving? Well, maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kinda, yeah. Okay, I'm still gonna hit up. Um, I'm totally embarrassing. Yeah. It's what? It's embarrassing taking them by yourself. It's embarrassing you came all the way out here expecting me to hold your hand. Uh oh. <laughs> Whoa, careful. I've not got I a lot of time to make like those choices. Or... Be cool. What? Fucking Julia hell. And Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Yes. All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry, I'm a little snappy. I'm just the new medical school would be stressful, you know. Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing, Julia, it's been rough. 
Yeah, I got you. It must be tough. No worries, man. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah, I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. Right. Oh, for fuck's sake, Joel. It's Conrad with a C. Hey! So, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? It's, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying Why to Why am I seeing his feet, about. bro? About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? How to know what's the right thing to do. Uh, fuck it. Let's be um. Go with your gut. Cliche as fuck. If it's right, you'll know. Cliche as fuck. Going where you go. Hey. Hello there. Ha <laughs> ha. Good timing. <laughs> okay now. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, I might, man, I might Conrad. call Conrad Connie next time I talk to him. This. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. Bradley! I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me. Hey, man. Want to crack the cold one with me? Every second. Uh, no, yeah, like, we we'll are relaxed as yeah. well. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Tight. Uh, I, I love beer. <laughs> that is such... The way you said that, you don't love beer, bro. I, I, I love beer. <laughs> you don't love beer <laughs> if you're saying it like that. <laughs> right on, Brad. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Like the cut of your shit. I drink alcohol. Uh, it's jib. <laughs> don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Nope. Um, no, actually. Never done it before. Water virgin. Nice. Yes, wow. sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Where's the old crust bucket skipper, anyhow? Oh. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but uh I'm just saying, those are some short shorts, bro. I'm just saying. So is everybody on board I had to say to it, those are some very short fucking like You know what I mean? Uh, you're selling, I'm buying. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I get fucked. You know, look at water. <coughs> nice. That's it. Get it all out. Uh, yeah. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. No, you know, literally, I am so glad that I actually am not seasick whenever I've been on a boat. It must be so fucking awful. <laughs> what about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this reptile before. Dive cam, yeah. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Brad did his homework. If he says a wreck's here, it's here. <laughs> okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Have I lost? I don't know. That's. Uh, uh, I just. Oh shit! Rip. Traits. 
Okay. Fuck. Bradley's gonna get all y'all motherfuckers killed. Feast your eyes on this. Hope not. Ooh. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Um, but I'm going to say nothing, man. Guys, no one knows, no one cares. No harm, no foul. The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine. As long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. <sighs> oh, I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine? Untouched? <laughs> so a what? Why would a penguin be? I, I, mean, I don't even know where this is, but why would a penguin we be out be here? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Right out. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. All right. Uh. Almost got the gear. Good to go. Need an extra hand? Never used a rebreather before. I think we're in good shape. Probably not a bad no idea for you to have a clue how these things work. Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. You're saying that right? She's not. She can hear you saying that. If she tries to keep me from doing this dive one more time, that's it. Gloves off. That's you, fair. Just yeah. don't force her hand. All right, Julia. I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up, and then we'll go through the final steps together. Julia, Ooh. you're saying that Solid with a loud ready. voice. Fliss can hear you, love. Like, surely. I'm almost done with these. Fliss is just there, Ooh. quietly going, you motherfuckers. 29, why was it turned off? Do you know how to use that? Uh, no. Not really. You might want to just let it do its thing. F. How are you, Fliss? I did. Do I have a. I did. Okay, never mind. I don't anymore. Where is Brad? What's up? How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey. All part of the adventure. Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, dude. Be more than that, just a script trip. Just get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Yeah, let's not be a dick to him. Uh, anything else I can explore? I'm not sure Julia left anything on the mainland. Smelled as good as it cost. At least it made her happy. Damn. Shroud of Innocence. Locked, whatever that is. I'm guessing it's a toilet or something. Huh. What am I looking at here? Oh. Premonition. Alright, so Brad's getting up for something, okay. Okay. What's the lunch? The 
it? Why does it say wait? No, 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 it does not say height without an e. There's no. It's a, it even. I thought it was just a spell mistake on the right. No, legit. It actually just says the full name like that and the height spelt wrong on the thing. That is. Uh, that is. Um, this doesn't look kosher. Yeah, and that's not spelt right either. Yeah, that's not, like, legit. <laughs> that is not legit. That's faked to high heaven. I'm telling you. So obviously a fake. I don't trust you, Fliss. How's Conrad doing? There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. Right. Oh yeah. Hey guys, tanks are ready. Tanks a lot. Did he just say tanks a lot? Oh, terrible. A terrible pun. Alright, let's go. Come on, let's dive. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than mm -hmm. a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Epic. Okay. O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver. You gotta check your O2 first. Thanks for sending me straight. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. Clown you behave, fishes. Connie. Oh, he's got a knife. Looking for a first mate. Uh, what the fuck's one of them? Well, I don't even know what either one of them is. I know the way to the front. You're on camera. I'll take the wheel. Let's get a before photo. All right, what was kids. that on the right? Good to go. Just remember the rules, please. Oh, let's be romantic. Maybe we can fire it up again tonight for our private post dive special. <laughs> Are you gonna bring your bang stick? <laughs> Whoa. That front cabin is gonna pop its portholes. Oh. <laughs> oh, keep talking. You dirty bastard. <laughs> Fucking hell, fire. Well, let's go for a dive for the wash. Here we go. Whoa, you good? More or less. Hello there. Hello, Joe. Welcome back. Oh, is that a shark? This place is so tight. She acts like we're going to ransack the plane. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> It's not like we can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. That's what she said. Damn. Sorry. It's pretty intact, too. It's like an instinctual thing for me just to... remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Captain, you fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command, third in command. No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Um. Look, now nah, the captain needs to focus, bro. Sorry. Pass, I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? Uh. Mm. 
Go on. You know it's not polite to ask a lady about her money. Fair enough. I was just thinking about buying a boat myself, and I thought maybe you'd like to point me in the right direction. Fuck it, why not? It would be my singular pleasure to help you part with your money. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Aye, aye, Captain. Wait, so that was on during the... Weather looks clear. Alright. I have to keep an eye on those clouds. Mm-hmm. Oh. Wait, what? It's getting mighty crowded out here. Are they getting closer or going away? Okay. I'm going down here. Wait, why is this door open? It wasn't earlier. Okay. Ah, another picture. Go in. Wanna see the picture? They give me a premonition. Why do I keep these around? Okay, I don't know who the hell that is. Is this like a little small ass bedroom? It is, isn't it? Okay. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. I hope they know what they're doing down there. Attitude matters 20 meters down. Alex plays the goof, but he was pretty serious about acing his diving certification. Fuck it. Are you close with your brother? Known him my whole life. No shit, bro. Julia's got Alex wrapped around her little finger. Huh. Gotta get back up to No up. shit, you've known Check him your whole life. Still. <laughs> okay. Alright, uh, point it down. What is this? Uh, was that about. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fucking read that again, please. I didn't get a chance to read that. <laughs> oh, shit. Formal notification that you are in default of your obligation to make regular repayments on your personal loan. The loan holds a remainder of $24,783 with a sum of 3481 payable by 1st of August 2019. This was... Okay... Fuck. Ouch. Ouch. Whoa, what was that? Why am I looking at my own? Wait, always check your gear, plan your dive, never be afraid to abort a dive, never hold your breath. No limitations, the sun from your dive safe, look at yourself fit, no vital skills. Please use the body system. I'll always use the body system. Just reading those rules. Ah, uh, but Alex already saw that earlier. And I've we've already seen it. It you're a fraud. Hey you're a hanging. fraud for us. You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. Ah. Uh, yeah, go with that one. charm is not among them. Ah, but my charm is like a boomerang. You think it's gone right over your head until smack. You're out cold. That makes no sense. Whoa. Uh... I don't know, do I? I don't know. You need to mind the speed limit, Buster. Hey, I like life in the slow lane, too. Nice and slow. I'll see you later, Conrad. I hope so. 
Okay. Check this. Wow. That is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. Wow, clowns. Alright, Friss, Jesus. Was it Fliss? I can't remember now. It's Fliss. Can I look? I remember the names. What's that? Oh. Is there anybody out there? Oh. What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? I'm only going for that this feels off one because of that premonition. Doing a one out of there going back rounds. Hey, we got damage here. You see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? No. Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it 20. Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. Oh, no. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Why has he just done that? Why has he just done that? Why? Right now he's definitely gonna wanna shoot. Shoot on him now. Right, how are these two going on? How is um, Alex and uh, Julia going on? Is there anything good in this shipwreck? Or plane wreck, well, I don't know what you wanna call it. Nice. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Yep, really? it was at the tail. The rear turret. Mm-hmm. Huh. Good on you, Conrad. It's a very thin opening, though. The turret. We can get in through there. Can ya? I sure as hell know I couldn't. I'd be careful with that shot. Oh, careful. Could be dangerous. Exactly. So worried about the uh, oxygen uh, tank then. First? Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we <laughs> did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time now. So she's what so I think Connie might get shot. Might have to avoid Connie getting shot. I keep saying Connie, not Conrad. Can I have to uh, avoid Conrad getting shot? Julia, leave it. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. It's not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Fuck. No. Maybe it is kind of dangerous. The bullets. Very nice. Bullet hole. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Hmm. What's this on the left? Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. 
think they were using it? Probably. Let's see what else we can find. I mean, if it's missing for this long, I'd assume that they've used it. Good God. Hello. It's <laughs> holding something. Oh, it's so sweet. Wow. What the hell happened here? We died, didn't we? The look of things. They knew they were goners. Uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. Want to go first? Well, what if you need a knife now? Okay, he's got a gun, has he? A gun? Okay. Take the gun. Whoa, whoa. I think I went my wetsuit. Life gives you lemons. Ew. Pilot and co pilot. Fucking God. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. That got me good. Holy shit. Oh my god. Fucking hell. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <sighs> yeah. We're gonna dislodge the ship. You know, I need to get I need to get a heartbeat monitor. I'm telling you. Where am I getting out of here? I don't know. I guess so. Fuck it. I'm just gonna go for it. Oh, fuck. Fuck. I hope I don't die. Oh, you, you bastard. Shit, I need to get this next one. Chill, dude. Search, search area. Okay, so they were searching there. This says it was a rescue plane, launched from a U.S. base. Kowalski. Oh. They were on their way to help out a ship. Shark, not interested in us. Let's go. 
Go, go, get out of the water. Get out of the water now. Uh, oh, okay. thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. Uh, Are you know. really yes. popping the queue down here? Oh. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh-huh. Julia, will you marry me? Julia, I'm serious. Just fucking say yes. Alex, wow. Oh, shut up, Sam. How did story? How's it end? Yes, oh. yes, I'll marry the shit out of you. Oh. <laughs> Kinky. Alright, handsome hero. You want to get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? Cliff, this is Julia. Fucking can't. Uh, do you know what? I've never. <sighs> Did Conrad get shot? Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Fuck. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. They need to go up there now. Oh my god, this is taking too long. This is torture. Just a few more seconds. Uh, okay, now. Go, go. Fuck. Oh no, they're good. What the hell is going on? What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. That looked like a mad explosion. There was a little uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. Yeah, why are you paying the ocean? <laughs> so, why are you paying the ocean? A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. They got caught on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what you guys find? Well, we found the plane. And it is huge. Full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys. Can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, bro, congrats. Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. Yeah, you know, I never thought someone could like propose on the water while diving. That's just kind of mad, you know. Fair play. Oh, we're back with a cura curator. You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. Mm. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. Arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss. Strong, forthright, stubborn. Do I detect a spark between her and Conrad? I don't know. Let me reassure you. You help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, creator. I know what I'm doing. I know how to tell a good story, okay? Well, I don't. I mean, I'm getting like half a story given to me. Well, he's not in chat at the minute, but I was playing, so uh, like I was streaming games with him earlier. Certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball. Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you find Probably the Probably his ring? ass. A lady never tells. Well, needless to say, this lady was impressed. <laughs> well played there, Mano. Wasn't Conrad going to get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? 
Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. All right. So, how does it feel to soon be known as the Mr. Julia Smith? Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel, but now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So, I guess we should talk about wedding plans, eventually. Uh... Now you're speaking my language. I'm taking lessons. And I can't wait for us to plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. Um... Of course. Of course I was gonna say yes, you dimwit. I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. Okay now. Wait. Let's be playful. Like a rug so you can walk all over me. Where did everyone go? There was much celebration to be had. I'll go find them. You just relax. Hey, I thought you see my brother? Or yeah, Fred? I thought he was gonna look for. Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. What? What? Yeah. Why wasn't Why wasn't he looking? Oh. Damn. Damn. All right, let's. I'm no worries. Thank crying, you for watching. <sighs> Sorry to interrupt your seven seconds in heaven. Oh yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. Huh? <laughs> Fucking! I knew that's what was going on. I just knew it. All right. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Yeah, look at the photos. So, how's it feel to be a man post proposal? Believe me, I'm uh, been carrying that around for a while. Oh, there you go. Good photos, mate. Oh, go back. Air rescue service, Conwyn Island. So Right. Uh, yeah. It seemed a little too dangerous for my blood. Don't sweat it. I'll go down with you and we'll be fine. That's uh, not Hey, almost time for barbecuing. Got the pad yet? Oh, no. Not yet. I got distracted. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. Easy, tiger. We should get back. Fucking hell, man. Right here. You'll get no resistance there. All right, everyone, check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? Hell yeah. So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. 
Wow. Do you find anything else? There was a flight plan on board that seemed to indicate it was a rescue plane. Yeah, that makes sense. After the war, they turned long-range bombers into rescue planes. And then this plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. It must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the love. No, hey, they were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Whoa. Oh, come on. No one knows we've even been down there. And I don't think ghosts can talk. You Americans are all the same, huh? No respect for anyone else's traditions. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Ooh. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? So I'm just gonna yeah, I heard move my event list. Happened right around here too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. All right. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Oh, lovely. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait. True story? Where'd you hear this? Ah, well, down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards, and for a dollar. He told me his secrets. <laughs> Seems legit. Just a the dollar. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. He of the one track mind. The woman answers, I live here in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twists. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, That isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical and insists her parents are upstairs. So they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an nice. axe. Nice. So gross. Okay, so who did it? So the woman, uh, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still here in the closet. Dun dun dun. Huh. The husband, eh? <laughs> So is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseas. You're locked in. Mm -hmm. So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and sure enough, there's a man inside. Well then. But he's cut his own throat. Hey. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. 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 And he sees it's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> well, uh, so gross. Hey, well, super that one actually didn't get me. <laughs> that one didn't get me. Nice one, Squire. You have me going. Pretty cool. Hit me on the cheese there, corn dog. Okay, you've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required one more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following <laughs> orders, man. I'm into this website. <laughs> and four good buddy. And I'm out. Yep. 
Brad is the sensible one. <laughs> <laughs>